Use the watercolour to give you your... Um, now this is dry paper? This is dry paper. Yep. Just to do whatever it does. When you're putting in your washers, initial wash... some bits that are fairly cool. Did you put your, your warm and cool in, in your watercolour? Much about McCool's because I can put them in with, with pastel. Now that's taken how long to do that? Four minutes. Four minutes. Woof, woof, me. <laughs> what did you add there, Frank? Uh, ultramarine and... Okay, what? Well. And to get that lighter blue, what was that? Was that... Okay. Oh, <laughs> Morning tea time. It's please. gone. Okay, that's it's gone. gone. <laughs> that's not the colour I wanted, but never mind, that'll do. Oh, yuck. That, in case you didn't know, the tree. was a macro carpentry. No use looking up at the screen. <laughs> just touch your computer. So you're using charcoal now, not pastel. This is charcoal. See, the charcoal is really fine. It's finer than the pastel. And that's getting a lovely, lovely grain in the... Oh, I like that. Mm. Oh, look at that, isn't that nice? I'm, I'm twisting the twisting the stick characteristic yeah. of macrocarpa. Yeah. Stringy things. And I'm looking at the twists in the um, in the trunk. It actually mm -hmm. twists around this way. Mm -hmm. There's a lovely highlight right there. And I haven't put it in, but I can put it in with pastel afterwards. And there's some very, very nice brown. Well, you've got the idea for that. And I'll just continue to work over the top of that. I'd like to show you how to get a highlight. Ah mm -hmm.
Time after time, I've all. 